everyone, welcome to Walks with Holly. In case you're joining me for the first time, I am Holly and I am a housewife and mom of four kids. I'm also a homeschooling mom and I do a lot of homeschooling, lifestyle, mommy, and cooking videos. So if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please hit that subscribe button right now. It would really help my channel grow and just support it all together. In today's video, I'm going to be making again one of our favorites and it's called Hawaiian Teriyaki Chicken in the Crock Pot. So let's get started. This is all the ingredients I will be using. As you can see, there's not a lot. This is a very simple recipe. I'm going to use teriyaki marinade, pineapple chunks plus their juice, chopped green bell peppers, crushed garlic, and cornstarch. I'm going to be cooking everything in my crock pot. First, I'm going to drain my pineapple juice. And once I drain out all the juice, you'll see that it ends up being about a cup of pineapple juice. So I'll put this to the side and we're going to get a mixing bowl out. First, we're going to pour the teriyaki marinade in. And this is going to be one and a half of these 12 ounce containers that I'm going to pour in my pineapple juice. And then two tablespoons of crushed garlic. Now I just use canned crushed garlic, but you can use fresh garlic and crush it yourself if you prefer. Next, I'm gonna give this a good stir with my whisk. Next, I'm gonna add my chicken to the crock pot and I'm gonna be using frozen chicken pieces, both chicken breast and chicken thighs, boneless and skinless. And I'm gonna be doing five chicken breast and five chicken thighs. Next, I'm gonna just pour the pineapple chunks on top of the chicken. And then I'm gonna pour a whole bag, it's a 10 ounce bag here, of chopped green bell peppers. And again, you can use fresh bell peppers if you prefer. I would use two if you're gonna do that. Then I'm just gonna pour all my sauce onto the chicken. And that is it. That is all you need to do. Then I'll put the lid on the crock pot and churn it on low. And I'm gonna let this cook on low seven to eight hours. We'll come back to it later. And after seven to eight hours is up, you can open up your lid there and see that your chicken is fully cooked. I'm just gonna take my chicken pieces here take them out and once they're on the cutting board I'll just go ahead and chop it up and as you can see the meat is super tender and falls apart. Next I'm going to get my cornstarch out and I'm just going to do a tablespoon of cornstarch and I'm just going to mix this in with a little bit of water to break it up and then I'm going to add the cornstarch to my sauce and then I will turn my crock pot on high just to get it more heated up for stirring. I'll just go ahead and give this a good whisk just to incorporate everything in there. And then once I've got that stirred up, I'm going to add my chicken back to the sauce. So as you can see, it's all chopped up here. And so we'll go ahead and add this to the sauce and let it just soak in the flavors. But that is pretty much it. That is all you need to do. It is ready for dinner. So we like to have this on a bed of rice. We also like to steam some broccoli and add that to the dish is a good combination. But that is the whole thing. And if you want the written instructions, it'll be in the description box below. All right, well, that was Hawaiian teriyaki chicken in the crock pot. And again, we just love this recipe. Super easy to make. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And I hope that again, you'll hit the subscribe button. But again, I appreciate you watching today and I hope to see you next time on Walks with Holly.